Missionary Flights International transports missionary families, teams, cargo, and life-saving supplies to Haiti, the Dominican Republic, and the Bahamas. With God's leading, Don Belden founded Missionary Flights from his dreams as a young man who realized the need and potential of aircraft and mission work. In over 56 years, the Lord has led Missionary Flights from a one-man, one-plane operation in West Palm Beach, Florida, to become a 20-person staff operation with over 50 monthly volunteers, two Douglas DC-3 aircraft, a Cessna 310 airplane, and operating out of two hangars in Fort Pierce, Florida. Missionary Flight's motto, Standing in the Gap, is taken out of Ezekiel chapter 22, verse 30. The Lord says to the prophet Ezekiel, I sought for a man among them who would make up a hedge and stand in the gap before me. As we share some of the work that we have been involved in over the last year, God's leading will be evident. We serve over 500 Christian nonprofit organizations, and our relationships with them are a daily reminder to us that we do more than just fly airplanes. It has been said by many of our affiliated missionaries that we are able to make their work more effective and more efficient. And along with this great privilege to be a foundational support for missionary work, we know that it is you, our prayer warriors and financial supporters that enable us to provide dependable service to those on the front lines sharing the gospel. We encourage you to give today and make an impact on missionary work for years to come. Missionary Flight saw a busy year in 2019 as we responded to riots and political unrest in Haiti, along with the disaster of Hurricane Dorian in the Bahamas. Most months of the year, Missionary Flights will make three to four flights a week to Haiti or the Dominican Republic, transporting missionaries and cargo. With the unrest in Haiti, MFI flew additional flights to rescue missionaries and their families out of dangerous areas. We also responded to the devastation brought about by Hurricane Dorian in the Bahamas. With the help of a Cessna caravan and pilot crew from Priority Air, we began flying 10 or more flights a week. The Missionary Flights hangar was turned into a full-scale disaster relief operation. Receiving and packing donated goods and coordinating an increase of volunteers arriving to sort donated items, pack boxes, and load airplanes. From September to December, the pilots and staff at Missionary Flights worked eight to 12 hours a day, six days a week. For a better perspective on numbers, in 2019, MFI flew a total of 255 flights. Those flights included transportation of work teams, life-saving medical supplies, and relief aid for disasters. But most importantly, the wings of our DC-3 carried messengers of the gospel to share the light and love of Jesus Christ. MFI flew 4,445 passengers between Haiti, the Dominican Republic, and the Bahamas. Some of those were families escaping violence, while others included teenagers experiencing missionary work for the first time overseas. Due to the need created by Hurricane Dorian, we transported over 1 million pounds of cargo last year. Items such as backpacks, tents, building supplies, hospital beds, and Bibles. With each flight, each person, each item, Missionary Flights stands in the gap for the advancement of the gospel in order to increase the efficiency of missionary work. To our partners, both financially and in prayer, thank you for making the following stories possible.